Hi everyone. So today I am going to show you hopefully my last review on my cheese. This is the cheese that it's been since, let's see, July 10th. So you know that this cheese does need to be aged a bit. Okay, ready? Here it is. And there are my slices. Mmm, taste is fantastic. So this one, maybe I aged it a little too long, but it's still doable and it's still good. So there are my slices. You can slice them nice and thin. And it's very good. Let me finish this, okay, Amanda? So, there you go. That is the texture of the cheese. And now this has been, what, over a month? Amanda, do you want to come and try this cheese? Sure. So, the Hi, longer... Hi, blend. <laughs> there you go. Mmm. Look at that. That is good cheese. There oh, you wow, go. that's really good. So, there you go. The longer you mm. wait, the firmer the cheese is going to oh, get. Oh, you do this. It's good. it's good. Wow, it's really good. You know what? And it has a nice cheesy taste. If that gets this harder... Is, this is my potato cheese. If that gets harder, and if you... Oh, you look so cute, Mumsy. Nana's recording. Um, Wanna say hi? If that gets harder... Wanna try Nana's cheese? Try Nana's Mace, cheese. This is good. Wanna try it, Mason? Mom, if you get that harder... You could grate that like Parmesan. Oh yeah, you could grate this for awesome. sure. But we want it more like a, a... <laughs> Would you like a bagel with that? No, I just want a little piece. Mmm. Yeah. <laughs> you don't know what you're missing. Mmm. <laughs> a bunch of momos. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go, guys. Yeah. That is my cheese. And now this has been aging. Um... How long has it been aging? Since uh, July 10th, what date are we today? Almost a month. So the longer you wait, uh, the longer it gets better. Now, Songbird, I know you're having problems pulling out your cheese, but what you could do maybe is just put paper on the top of the uh, your Tupperware, do not put the lid, and maybe leave it upside down and wait till the cheese wants to come out. It's it's not the end of the world if your cheese doesn't want to slide out right away. Maybe you can put a knife on the inside of the container and just gently massage the container to release the cheese and then wrap it up. But this is what your cheese is going to be like. This is the potato cheese that I have up. This is the last one. Let me just do... <laughs> I just want another piece. Sorry, YouTube land, but you really don't know what you're missing. My and daughter she's, just loves she's my, my mama. <laughs> <laughs> That's my oldest daughter, Amanda. So there you go. That's what it looks like on the inside. You want more? I guess the cheese is good, guys, because they want more cheese. Here you go. Would you like? Would you like a bagel with that? Would you like some bagel? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm gonna get your bagel. Come, come. I want to show how pretty you are. Mom, my name's CJ. You're not TJ, you're Bella Bean, no, right? I'm TJ. <laughs> I'm going to give you a bagel. So there you go. We know the cheese is good because they've eaten it. Right? Bagel? Come here. Now I'm going to cut your bagel. Come here, Bella. So, we know the cheese is good, guys. So, have patience wait and like i said songbird if you're having problems pulling it out it will come out eventually maybe you can just um help it guide it out here you go bella don't forget to subscribe to the channel <laughs> don't forget to subscribe you're gonna come back and tell that to the people okay mm -hmm. so sorry about that guys i'm sorry we're all over the place today but i do have my grandkids over my daughter had a doctor's appointment so, Nana was here to take over and watch her kids. 
but back to the cheese it has a nice salty cheesy taste and the longer it sits the better it is so um, there you go I hope you like this recipe guys and I hope you give it a try and I hope you have patience where you just let it age and you let it age appropriately that was a butt that I cut off and this is grated cheese I'll show you this was the butt end that I cut off last time I checked but just to show you like my daughter said you can grate it if you let it age longer you get like this is still too soft but if you just let it age this is what you get you get like parmesan and this is just a butt that I'm using you get little parmesan shreds so longer it sits the longer it ages now this cheese would have been done a long time ago I only kept it this long because I wanted to show you what it's like as it ages but otherwise this would have been eaten a long time ago I still have half that's wrapped but I waited just for the video otherwise it's hard to not eat this cheese and like I said this is not a melting cheese it's more a cheese where you want to put it in between some bagel or you want to just eat it like that as finger food but it's very good so I hope you give this cheese a try and I want you to come back and let me know how you like it after you've aged it because if you don't get it to age you're gonna have a very soft creamy cheese so guess what guys I'll see you in my next video come Bella Bella so what do we tell them say come back come back and don't forget to subscribe to and don't forget channel. to subscribe to the channel thank you Bella thank you guys I'll see you in my next video for more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawsome Kitchen, give it a thumbs up, and share it with your friends.